Hello. Okay, so let's talk about the second episode. Second episode, Family by the Time, the Andersons. Okay, so oh, it was just a lot. It was a lot. It was a lot. It was a lot. Like I think I just know too much. So I must try to start from the beginning, but it's a little sketchy. <laughs> okay. Let's start with Shataka. Um, she put on a show. That was a show. Um, I really want the best for her. Um, I want the best for her. And I think she is afraid. And I think she's actually... She would never say she's giving up on herself. She would never say that. Um, because she, you know, and I, and I get it, I get it. I think she, you know, she wants it to look right or sound right, you know. Watch her, out, vehicle stopped on shoulder ahead. Um, her story or whatever, but, um, so by the time, so this is actually literally two years in. I know you got, our timelines are different. So this is, we're in 2019. Yeah, this is like two years in. And Dr. Parker said he needed her to lose about, you know, 30 or 40 pounds. You know, especially in the beginning, 30 or 40 pounds in a month. With, you know, for the type, for the amount of weight that she, she has. You know. Watch out, vehicle stopped on shoulder ahead. I think he said um, 30 or 40 pounds. Anyway, at this point, two years later, she should have lost, I'm going to say a minimum of 30, I mean 30, 300 pounds, right? Okay, so you have the scene that her, her trainer um, was in the kitchen dumping some of the the food. Um, yeah, it was, that was that was how it looked when I was there. Um, she does have food in her room, unfortunately. Um, she has still probably watch out. Vehicle stopped on shoulder ahead. She probably still has that uh, cook plate or hot plate, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, so it was pretty scripted. I can tell it was pretty scripted. Um, the, 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 I don't know what to say about, um, she talked in her journey. She could be further along. Um, I wish that the part, um, when they were talking about, um, having a psychologist, I remember that moment. She knew how to answer the questions to get past where she needed to, you know, be with Dr. Proctor. Um, she knew how to answer those questions. But I really wish that that whole show would truly care about their weight loss journey. Um, because I just don't believe that they really do. I'm trying to figure out what the purpose of this second season for them are. Um, because they're, they're in the same position, if not worse. Uh, and they might be in a, a little worse for the simple fact that you know, you hear them talking about the, the, um... Watch out. Vehicle stopped on shoulder ahead. It's traffic. That's why. Um, the, the honeymoon stage. Well, they're, they've been out of the honeymoon stage. So, at this point, you know, it is what it is. Um, it's, you know, um, the celebrity status that they think they have, they don't. It's really, it's really about their health. And I would just hate to see you know, Shataka's gaining weight to get back into that position that she was in when I met her. It was it, it was not good, a good thing. You know, she was not getting out of the bed, and I'm noticing 
that she's still sitting down like the trainer she was sitting on a bench outside and the trainer was having her do whatever you know bicep curls give me a break it's not the bicep curls that she needs the most help with why are you just doing that's what we were doing two years ago that's how she got out of the bed why are you still doing that minimal exercise that just does watch out object on road ahead I love, this is ways. They tell you everything that's on the street, everything that's going on. I, I love ways of the GPS. But um, why are you do, still doing that stuff? So she's still sitting down, you know, in between everything, you know. I saw her standing in the kitchen. In 4.7 miles. Exit to exit 20, I-75, the U.S. 41, Atlanta, Marietta. Chattanooga. I'm in Atlanta, y'all. So, um, and then y'all know my business where I'm going. But, <laughs> but why her standing in the kitchen moving like that, um, she's not doing that. I can guarantee you she's not doing that. But why? It was sort of upsetting to me. It's like, why are you? It looks like she's going backwards. I hate that for her. Like, we worked really hard to get her out that bed and get her on the, um, in the living room, then outside with and to, to the doctor. We worked hard, um, but it looks like you know it's not working. So the trainer that she has now, um, I don't know why I was about to call her Vivica. It is not Vivica. It is not Lillian. I forgot. I forgot her name. But anyway, she was at the reunion of last year so she had started working with Chautauqua shortly before now pay attention if she was at the reunion show that means that show was filmed a few months before it was aired that was a while ago that was oh, that was watch a out vehicle stopped on shoulder ahead but it was a while ago so she started working with her now if she started working with her that far back and it's still showing that the Shatak is gaining weight. What is really going on? You, you see what I'm saying? What is really going on? Shatak is gaining weight. She's been walk, working with her for months. Um, she's doing exactly what I've already done is going in there, you know, going through her, her food. Now, her refrigerator is chaotic. It looks extremely healthy. Her food is not in the refrigerator that she's eating that's not good for her. The food that she's eating that's not good for her is either in her room um, on the side of the bed or people are bringing it to her at um, different times. Um, and that's just what it is. You know, reality shows are not reality. That's exactly what it is. Um, pretzels. Shataka should not be eating pretzels even though it 